Certainly, and especially, too, that's exactly what you'd have to expect from Jocelyn Tate, brother of Jay Sean, the ex-Ohio State athlete. Tate thought about setting up for that three. She goes in, beautiful pass there to A-Roll, and A-Roll gets to go off the right block. They average 40 rebounds per game, and they're looking to replicate that number as Joyner thought about lining up a three. She'll drive to the right wing. She'll pull up. She'll get it to go. It's Dozier. Dozier can't get it to go. Elliott with the board. Hands it over now to Halleck. Halleck pushing the motive quickly. She goes to the Euro step. Left hand. Pretty move. Watch out. Trying to go to that spin move once again. She tries to go to that right block. And the cutter back door for Kimball. Setting it up. Arol, she can shoot the three. She'll drive in. Good entry pass to Tate. Tate now with the layup, and she gets it to go. Thomas battling her, it around on the free throw line now. As here's Jocelyn Tate forcing a turnover. Hageman now coming the other way. She goes to the hesitation. And gosh, she's a peer scorer, a bona fide 20-point-per-game athlete. She's on pace for that once more. Osmond now looking inside for Ming. Ming corrals it. Looking for the cutting Elliott, not to be. Osmond will go to the left, spin move, post hook, and she'll get it to go. For Michigan State, they're able to take it to their offensive side. Tomasovo couldn't get it to go. We see the field goal percentage from both teams. Spartans dominating. Ball at the moment. Anna Stryverson will give it to her sister for three, and that's a wonderful connection. Sister to sister for three. Aral now at the wing. Here's Tate for three. She got it to go. Stryverson now with the Euro step, not to be denied by Aral and Didi Hageman going the other way, and she'll get the easy layup to go. Waiting for her teammates to run the floor. Aral now has it in the post. Back out for three. Joiner, yes! Now here comes the Purple Aces once again. Just too fast there with Stryverson. Elliott now coming the other way. Elliott finds Joiner in the wing. Joiner for three, yes! Coming the other way. Beautiful spin move there from Evansville. That was Tomakova there with the layup. Yeah. In and control by Tom and Sova for sure. Lauren uh, Ross. Theron Hallett coming the other way. The Spartans want to run. Lauren Ross, she will two dribble, pull up for three. She got it to go. Elena Stryverson now looking for that entry pass. Osmond again with the steal. She's looking to press. She goes down for the left handed layup and a huge block there. I believe that was Palomo running the floor. It starts with having the intangible things go your way, such as Mang camping out there in the restricted area. Lauren Ross wants it in the corner. She has it in the corner, and she'll make it in the corner. This is a Missouri Valley team that, that was picked to finish 11th of 12. There's many reasons to believe that they will finish higher than that. Tonight, they've just struggled with poor shooting. So make no mistake, they'll be back as Stryverson with a three. That's going to pay dividends when you get into the late portion of the year. Darren Halleck with the stop and go. She'll give it to Bree Robinson for three. Bree Robinson will answer. And for the Spartans, you're looking at that stat and you're hoping that it's a sign of the times and you're hoping to get that win streak once again as Lauren Ross will drive in to the post, kick it out to Bree Robinson for three. She made one, she made two. Hartwig couldn't get the pull up mid range to go. Osmond thought about the deep three. She'll drive this time herself, and she'll get to, get it to go off the back of the rim. Lauren Ross now going with the left. Lauren Ross with the right, and she gets it to go. And one, Lauren Ross. In the Big Ten and around the country as well. Halleck now driving to the right block, trying to turn back to her left. She'll find Robinson in the corner. Robinson gets it to go again. And this unit from Robin Freilich has been playing very, very well. There's a Euro step from Smith. Big block from the Spartans because the talent at her level is undeniable as Halleck blocks the three. She'll go the other way and she'll get it to go with the layup after the pass from Lauren Ross. And think about it this way. For Halleck, this is an athlete who had five assists, eight turnovers through the first three games as that one banks home. But Halleck now totals eight assists, a game high, finds a way to make differences on all ends of the floor, and that's where we finish here today.